Hi everybody, I'm back with another video. This is a video sharing my hummingbird feeder with you. You see the little red and yellow bird um, hummingbird feeder? It's there once the birds come back from their long trip to the north. I got food in it and the hummingbirds can come and feed. And when they're here I will try to catch some pictures of them if I see them. Hopefully I will see them. We just see a lot of birds around here, all different kinds of birds. So I hope to capture some of these birds. I hear a lot of birds already. Hmm, beautiful. I'm not asking. That's my squeaky door. I need another door. But this door is 20 years old. So, time for a new door, but doors cost money. Okay, well, this is my video. I'm sharing you about these, about the birds. Hopefully. I will have some other feeders. I've been trying to figure out how to put up bird feeders to feed all these different birds I've seen, especially in this tree right here. This tree is a stump that fell. That was a stump when I moved here. 20 years ago, this was a stump. And this stump has grown this tall in 20 years. So, and this tree has a lot of birds in it. It has a lot of squirrels in it. I haven't never seen a snake in it. But then again, I don't really have a lot of snake issues on my property. Because if I see one snake, oh well, I, I got something for him, for them. But we did have one snake. It was a huge, gigantic anaconda. We came home and there was this giant snake print and they was like, what the? So it came out of that woods back there. And, 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 and I mean, it was obviously a snake thing because it crawled all the way. It went all the way there to the road. And we watched it because that grass was green then. And the grass, over there had actually been mashed down and had the print of this gigantic snake in it. We didn't see the snake. So the snake went across the road over there. So my husband called the game warden people, whatever, and had them come out and look at it, he says. And they were like, okay. Yep, they got to find him. But I heard they found him. They found he was a pet anaconda a neighbor or somebody out here let go I guess they didn't want him anymore I don't know but anyway why would a human who not living outdoors like campers bring an anaconda in your house to live with you <sighs> I'm not afraid of snakes respect those those snakes I respect snakes I will stand here and watch a snake crawl past my yard and I'll just stand here and just admire him like I did when I was a child this big old giant snake this crawl across our yard and me standing in the door like I'm doing and I standing in the door just watch that snake crawl across the yard and do he what to say we didn't go out there and play with them that we used to do the smaller rattlesnake. We used to play with them. Mama would go out and ch chop the snake up and kill him so he wouldn't bite us when we was little kids. And we would stand there and run around and play with him while he bite at us. But we knew how to get close. Did it as children. 